discuss about tripping scheme of eriva make eriva make 400 or 220 kb circuit breaker reference type of gl316d or gl314 the tripping control scheme of breaker has four section local trip pd trip pd means pole discrepancy trip remote trip and protection trip so discuss about local trip mode and details of pre-close post-close supervision relay now important part of trip circuit supervision scheme the trip circuit supervision are two part one is post post-close post-close supervision another is pre-close supervision the trip circuit supervision is trip circuit supervision particularly important in breaker which have only trip coil which are on the trip coil the trip circuit supervision relay continuously measures the resistance of trip coil of circuit breaker it also measures the control voltage of trip coil and given an alarm when the control voltage fell to low level. This circuit breaker are two trip coil that is PT2 TC1 trip coil 1 and another is trip coil 2 with DC source 1, this is DC source 1, another is trip, uh, DC source 1 for trip coil 1 and DC source 2 for trip coil 2. Hence the control circuit shown in contactor on CB off condition. Now off condition all contactor is shown. Now DC positive source from TB4. This is positive source. This is negative source. DC positive source come from TB4 terminal number 7 to DC control switch 1 CS1. This is DC control switch to fuse F7 the wire number K71 to TB4 terminal number 14 when the we local trip operate the 43A this is 43A local remote selector switch to the local mode now it has shown is remote remote now we get to local mode selector switch to the local mode. so positive source from TV4 terminal terminal number 14 to local remote selector switch this is local remote selector switch to terminal number B1 with the wire number K33 to trip neutral close switch to trip neutral close switch this is trip neutral 3 NC for trip neutral close switch now we can trip pulse now we can trip pulse the positive source this is positive source go through terminal number 2 this is terminal number 2 of TNC to a 3 contact of terminal number 13 this is our number K37 when we trip pulse of TNC switch then positive source to the A3 contact of terminal number 33 with wire number K37. A3 contact, A3 contact is a SF6 low pressure lockout contact. If the gas pressure is low, the contact remain in opposition. This is in opposition. That is open contact. Therefore, no positive pulse go through this contact. Now, tripping or closing operation of circuit breaker, it is mandatory the SFC gas pressure are healthy condition. Now, gas pressure is are healthy, so A3 contact is NC position. So, positive pulse, so positive pulse go through the A3 contact. 
from terminal number 33 33 to 34 of a3 counter and go to the a6 contactor and 62x contactor both are terminal number a1 the a6 contactor a6 contactor of a6 contactor and 62x contactor are trip 1 or trip 1 for a6 contactor are used and 62x used for pole discrepancy multiplier respectively this is negative source from tb4 this is negative source tb4 terminal number 8 terminal number 8 to dc control selector switch CS1 DC control selector switch and go through the link link 7 to the AC contactor AC contactor of terminal number A2 and 62X contactor for 62X is a pole discrepancy contractor contractor multiplier pole discrepancy multiplier of terminal number A2 and uh, trip coil this is trip coil of Trip coil 152TC1 of terminal number 2 of all phase. This is R phase, this is Y phase, this is blue phase, or this is pole 1, pole 2, pole 3. This scheme are drawing on circuit backer cubelic and this drawing for mechanical cubelic for R phase mechanical cubelic for y phase mechanical cubelic for blue phase this source already present a terminal number a2 of a6 contactor and 62x contactor therefore both this contactor are both this contact a6 and 62x contactor are energized and AC contractor of terminal number, AC contractor, this contractor is this contractor of terminal number 13 and 14 is to be NC position and 62X contractor, pole discrepancy multiplier, terminal number 21 and terminal number 22 is to be NC position. The positive DC source already present at A6 contractor of terminal number 13 the source come from TB4, this is TB4, come from TB4 terminal number 7 via DC, con DC control selector switch and fuse F S7 with wire number K71, wire number K71 through to the A6 contractor of terminal number 13 is already present of DC source, DC positive source. DC positive pulse go through the contactor of A6 terminal number 13 and 14 and contactor of 62X terminal number 21 and 22 to TB1 of terminal number 7 of circuit backer cube helix to TB1 terminal number 7, TB1 terminal number 7 for mechanical cubelics of R phase with wire number K23. To S1 contact, this is S1 contact of terminal number 3. Here S1 contact in between terminal number 3 and 4 are shown open and S1 contact in terminal number 11 and 12 are shown closed position respectively. This status show when the circuit breaker are in open position. If the circuit breaker is under normal running position that is closed position, the contact of S1, S1 contact 
is to change the position that is s1 contact in between 3 and 4 or in c position and s1 contact of 11 and 12 in no position respectively so positive dc source the positive dc source come from tb1 of terminal number 7 to s1 contact through terminal number 3 to 4 3 to 4 and go to to the uh, tb2 of terminal number 36 of 36 this is tb2 of terminal number 36 of this is mechanical cubic of r phase this is positive source from tb2 this is tb2 terminal number 36 of mechanical cubic to tb5 tb5 terminal number 36 of circuit breaker cubic this is circuit breaker cubic to a4 contact of terminal number 13 and 14 this is 13 contact this is dc positive source here and a4 contact is a sf6 low pressure lockout when it is gas pressure is low the contact is shown in open position gas pressure is low is open position now pressure is healthy so the a4 contact of terminal number 13 and 14 is to be nc position so dc so positive source positive dc source come from a4 contract of terminal number 13 to terminal number 14 to tb5 tb5 this is tb5 terminal number 37 as well as go to tb2 as well as go to tb2 terminal number 37 of mechanical cubic for r phase and finally to the finally to the trip coil this is trip coil 52 tc1 of terminal number one and already negative pulse already negative pulse present from tb4 to tb4 of terminal number eight this is a terminal to be control selector switch cs1 through link to tb1 of terminal number 19 to tb1 terminal number of 19 of this is mechanical cubic with wire number k74 to terminal number 2 of trip coil 1 so trip coil is energized the circuit breaker is to trip this arrangement is r phase this is r phase similar similarly as yellow phase blue phase here supervision of trip coil this is trip coil is supervision t close post close I discuss the negative DC source uh, patient this is negative DC source through to uh, patient at 52 TC1 coil and terminal number one go to through the through the S1 contract of terminal number four and terminal number 12 here negative pulse negative source terminal number from this to this the terminal number 4 and terminal number 12 of auxiliary switch this is s1 is auxiliary switch uh, if the breaker is open the dc negative source this is open the negative source through the contract terminal number 12 to terminal number 11 of the s1 contract to tb1 this is tb1 terminal number 8 with the wire number k23 double a k23 double a for pre close supervision scheme this scheme is pre close supervision scheme when the baker is closed the dc negative source through the contact 
of 4 and 3 the terminal of auxiliary contact this is in C position when the breaker is closed so negative source through to contact auxiliary contact S1 of terminal number, terminal number 4 to terminal number 3 to TB1 terminal number 7 to TB1 terminal number 7 and to through the terminal number 1 TB1 terminal number 6 and TB1 terminal number 5 with wire K23 this scheme is post closed supervision scheme when the Becker is on condition the release is post closed supervision scheme check and three coil healthiness check pre-close and post-close scheme already discussed then PD pole discrepancy scheme is here the pole discrepancy if the Becker is off condition this S1 contract of 13 and 14 also make contract and S1 contract of terminal number 5 6 is open condition and A5 is a pole discrepancy contract this is resistance if Becker is off condition so three pole R phase Y phase blue phase this is make condition make make that means NC position and 5 6 contract of auxiliary contact S1 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 is open condition it's open condition if Becker is closed this contact break contact this is open NO, NO, NC to NO, NC to NO, NC to NO, NC to NO. And this contact auxiliary S1, 5 and 6 to NC, NC, NC. If one pole is not to close, then the causes of this, this contact, suppose Y phase Becker not to close. So this contact is also not closed. This is NC position. So positive source already present. This for this contact, this auxiliary contact terminal number thirteen, and to go through to the terminal TB one terminal numbers eleven to through this path and go to it already close this to the A5 contact. So A5 is energized then pole discrepancy operated this, this contact is closed then the circuit is make to trip three phase trip is energized. So one pole is not to operate the pole discrepancy is energized and they cut to trip another pole. So this is scheme of tripping of Ediva make circuit breaker.